You ha These are the paths you have walked. This persona, a fee is required, then accept this persona. This persona, a fee is required, then accept this persona. Is this what you will withdraw this persona, then accept this persona. Is this a fee is required? This is your power. Done already? What? It is time, inmate.
Can I really do this? Excuse me! I'll go. Justine, read here. This person, you'll withdraw this person. This is your power. This a fee is required. This is your power. This per you'll withdraw this. This is your power. Is this what you want? Is this what you want? You can hold no more personas. Are you finished? What? here. This person will withdraw this then accept this persona. Are you finished? What? No slacking off! consultation with them from time to time and they're all very cheerful that goes for my fortune teller customers as well I've been getting thanked a lot more lately even by the people who get bad fortunes particularly when I tell them they can alter their fate that's very true all I used to say before was that they were going to face misfortune 
I had a best friend in the town I used to live in. She was the first person I read a fortune for. When she started avoiding me, I read the fortune of our fate. It was a terrible result. But I prayed that it would somehow work out. However, that never happened. That's when I started to believe that fate couldn't be changed. No surprise though, right? Because I didn't take action on my part to try and change it. I haven't talked to her in years. Maybe I'll try contacting her sometime. Yeah, you're right. Oh, could this be? Ah! <laughs> the power of conviction is amazing! Her feet and mine are connected! I will no longer be swayed by names like Monster or Maiden. I am simply a fortune teller who provides advice to people with broken spirits so that they will have conviction and face their future without getting pushed around by fate. That's the fate I've chosen for myself. <laughs> Thank you. Now, it's your turn to speak. What would your conviction be as a phantom thief? Sorry. I used fortune telling to find out your true identity. I couldn't help but think that you had something to do with the chairman's confession. Then I discovered that you're the trickster who causes a sensation in the world. It was the same card as the figure who helped me take down the chairman. <laughs> it finally struck home for me. Don't worry, I won't tell anyone. But I don't care what your true identity is. As long as you're around, I can always be my true self. So, it's fine. Only... The fate of the Phantom Thieves is rather unclear. The Arcana is set in a tricky position. You can almost say it's facing both heaven and hell. This is the first time I've ever seen anything like it. There's... No time to be worried. We must take action in order to change fate, right? I'll be by your side. As the fortune teller who changes fates, I will guide you so you can avoid misfortune. <laughs> I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of fortune, granting thee infinite power. strange sequence the cards were in when I read the fortune about your true identity. Several cards with strong personalities gathered around the trickster. It's quite improbable. It was almost as if it were trying to connect them together. You either have amazing charisma, or you're a trouble magnet. <laughs> the verification tests are over, but don't forget about me, okay? Please, visit again sometime. Goodbye!
Ah, you're back. Good evening. I look forward to it. should have known. Here, though, my whole world is expanding. Every day brings new and different discoveries. The direction of Sojiro's cowlick, the atmosphere of Yongen, the various types of coffee beans. Things might be the exact same as they were yesterday, but from my perspective, it's all spinning. I knew it was possible, but I had never really felt that sensation before now. I just hope I can keep changing little by little, like everyone else does. Yeah. Oh, by the way, I got a text from Kanachan saying she got a job at a convenience store. It sounds like she's just happy to be living life like a normal teenager. 
Plus, she got study guides with the money she made. She's gonna take the high school entrance exam. Even Kana-chan's trying to step out into the world. Yep, she's my new rival. So, you said you'd give me a reward if I completed my promise list, remember? <laughs> That's the Joker I know. You know, thinking about what to buy in Akihabara felt kind of different to me this time. There were plenty of things I wanted, but it was all stuff I could get if I worked really hard. And after all, I already have something I wouldn't have been able to get on my own. You don't think so? No, you're forgetting. You gave me something really important. You gave me my life back. It's thanks to you that I learned I'm fine just as I am. And that I learned to trust my mom again. I was as good as dead. But you resurrected me. I'd like to use my work with the Phantom Thieves to return the favor. Not only that, I realized... If I only act for my own sake, I can't put my full effort into it anymore. But when I remember my friends, and you, it's like I'm tapping into some kind of unknown power. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of the Hermit, granting thee infinite power. You gave me my life back, so it's my turn to risk my life for you. Feel free to tell me anything. I'll do whatever I can to help. I'm serious, okay? Leave it to me! And? I never said I was gonna let my reward go unclaimed. So, instead of training myself to be away from you, I want the right to not have to leave you. That way, I'll never be apart if I don't want to be. Really? <sighs> you know, I don't mind if my purpose is the same as yours. Not just as a thief, but in life too. Actually, I want it to be the same. So warm. <gasps> what? I'm crying? I don't understand. But this is my right until I say so. Don't let go of me. <laughs> well, not like I'd ever say that. Y you're okay with going home a little late today, right?
They're right. This is totally bizarre. What's going on here? Read here. Is this what you want? A fee is required. This is your power. Done already? What? It is time, inmate.
Hey.
Yo. Hey. All right, let's go.
Ah, you're back. All right. Let's go home.
We'll just have to wait. Oh, yeah. reason. See ya. Indeed. <laughs> Thank you. Indeed. Let us be off.
Could this be? How foolish. I decline. Did you say? You are unforgivable. Yes. Have my thanks. All right. Okay. Thank you. 
Well, shall we begin? Yo. Wanna get going? Ah, oh, this is a perfect way to refill after some training. By the way, the track team's up and running again. Yamauchi got taken down pretty quick. You know Takeishi's mom is the PTA press, right? He told her everything. After that, she came storming in with the other parents and forbid the whole scouting plan. Oh, wish I could have seen the look on Yamauchi's face. <laughs> I mean, the school can't ignore the PTA. And as a result, the track team's back. Our old coach is filling in for now. Man, it serves that dick right. <laughs> what a great feeling. I think they might even go far in the meet. Hell yeah! Oh crap, the ramen's gonna get soggy. Let's eat! Woo! <laughs> that was awesome. To tell the truth, I was scared of facing those guys straight up. I, I couldn't stand how much they hated me. It only just made me think of how stupid I was. Most of all, it made me remember how I lost my place with them. Hey, this ain't like me, but I managed to change because you were here helping me. I got you all wrapped up in this shit, but you stayed with me till the bitter end. You didn't abandon me, so thanks, man. <laughs> it's funny, huh? This started out as us training for the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> How'd it end up like this? Either way, it's my turn now. If anything comes up, you tell me. I'll help you with whatever you need. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the chariot, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. that off my chest let's do this first up I'll be counting on you leader and you can count on me too hey now that we're all fueled up want to race to the station Oh, 
Oh, honey. Hmm. Huh? Yep, replace the previous article. No worries, right? Might as well go all out if we're gonna do this. I'm gonna scrap the others and rewrite them as well. Yep, tomorrow morning then. Sorry, that was the chief. He's been great. He's ignoring the higher-up's orders to help me. I'm doing a special expose on the Phantom Thieves, and the Chief's helping me. It's about their origin and the root of the problem they're trying to solve. I think it really captures the spirit of journalism. It's my original field of expertise. I am a journalist, after all, you know? The higher-ups were against it, but this expose has been very popular with our readers. Since we've sold so many copies, there's nothing they can do about it. Or us. So, we're planning to throw in additional articles while we have the chance. This is only just the beginning, though. All right, let's throw a victory celebration. Lalachan, I hope you have some champagne for us. I told you last time, we don't have any of that here. That's what I figured, so I reserved a bottle at the wine shop. <laughs> okay, I'll go get it for you. Impressive. Looks like Lalachan took the hint. I wanted to speak with you, in private. I'll loosen up a bit, will ya? I've been quietly making preparations to write a story about Shido's confidant, too. I'm going to uncover the truth. I swear to Kayo. Thanks. Again. Whenever I felt like giving up, you encouraged me to keep going. It's all thanks to you that I was able to get this far, Mr. Phantom Thief. Chief's change of heart happened exactly the same way as those other cases. And the timing was absolutely perfect. You're the only one who could have orchestrated all that. It was so obvious. I'm convinced from all the recent coverage that the Phantom Thieves truly are valiant. Helping the weak. Punishing the bad. They actually do all those things. In a sense, you and I have the same objective. We both want to expose the ills of society. So, I won't tell anyone about your true identity. Let's form a united front to fight evil. If it weren't for you, I never would have been able to return to my journalist self. My high schooler source who manipulated information ended up manipulating my heart too. I'm gonna return the favor one of these days, all right? <laughs> Until then, we'll race to see who can expose evil first. I am thou, thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the devil, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. Anyway, where the hell is Lala-chan? Shall we get started then? Considering we're already in a celebratory mood. I wonder if you'll make it back home tonight. I'm gonna have you stick around till the very end. I will not accept your refusal.
We'll just have to wait for now. Thanks. All right.
Back when I met Shiho, when she saved me, I realized that personal relationships are something to be treasured. That's why I'm not going to run away anymore. I'll face myself head on. This time, it's my turn to help someone. But I'm still kind of worried. Do you think you could help me? Mm-hmm. You can lean on me too, if you need it. <laughs> I feel like we finally see each other eye to eye. I'm so glad I met you. To a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of the lovers, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. I'm gonna stop counting on you. After all, you're an eternal member of my fan club. It means forever. Got it? Anyway, let's eat before our food gets cold. Time to dig in! for today. Next time. Uh. 
this of you it's all good not like I have customers to deal with so this is what you grew yes I'd like an honest opinion from a culinary professional let me see to be honest both the taste and appearance are the opposite of what I'd call market grade I see but it's impressive you managed to grow anything at all up on a rooftop of all places. I'm honored to hear you say that. You know, I can't say it tasted good, but it was actually somewhat refreshing. Kind of like how you feel good after taking bitter medicine. Hmm. I first came across the plant in my house. It's possible that it's an experimental breed created for use at Okumura Foods. Thank you very much for the input, Sakura-san. I'll take note of that. He's right. That was the same thought I had. I think I understand what Sakura-san meant when he said they were refreshing. mind to provide value to the phantom thieves this is actually the only thing i can honestly say i'm good at thank you for worrying about me but i find the work relaxing hey um do you think you could help me out again sometime like you did today it's a deal <laughs> okay i'll do my best from now on Become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Empress Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. Still, he was right. The taste leaves much to be desired. Thank you! Give that shit to my customers. Good.
Indeed. <laughs> Indeed. Sorry. Hey! Hey! Yep. Yeah.
<laughs> I look forward to it. Indeed. <laughs> Head off. Ah, you're back. Ah, you're 
you're back. That's my intention. There were a lot of people who covered for me by saying that I was just being used by adults, but I'm the one who was most at fault. I was overconfident. If only I had taken a look at myself and properly assessed my shogi skills, I believed that with my skills, I could overcome being treated like an idol. There's nothing I can say about my mother. You didn't abandon me. Even after you learned about the fixed matches, now I know how encouraging it feels to have someone believe in you. At first, this was just a deal. You help me develop new moves and I give you shogi lessons. But before I knew it, you became... someone I couldn't do without. I'm not gonna pay attention to all the criticism anymore. This time, I'll earn everyone's praise with my own skills. The reason I'm able to think this way is because you stuck by my side. I'm really grateful. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the star. Granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. Well, then. I truly hope that you know that the Phantom Thieves find my lessons useful. Yes. I spoke to you about my mother, and then my mother changed. I knew that couldn't be a coincidence. If there's anything I can do to help, please know that you can rely on me. I will support you in whatever you want to accomplish. Now let's play a match. I have a lot of new moves I'd like to test out. I hope you're okay to stay here a while longer. Thank you. Well then.
your back. Welcome home! My goodness! How suspicious! Here you go! everyone. Real? I shall be your opponent. 
Stay in formation. Go for it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay.
treason. <sighs> Good. I still have much to learn, but I finally painted something that I can be satisfied with. Yes, this is the true heart of humanity. The title is Desire and Hope. What do you think? Well, I added aspects that were previously lacking. This light is all of you. The title lists hope. But, in my mind, it's a much more concrete thing. I can't believe I didn't realize that until now. Hmm. You. It's a good painting. Huh? It's not trying to be eccentric for the sake of being eccentric. Like the last time. To think the same painting can change this much. So this is the answer you've come up with. It is. Desire and hope, I see. Beauty and ugliness. Humans are creatures that possess both. It seems you understand that. What are you playing at? I apologize, although my intent was to encourage you. It was rather crude. Still, I believe that this ploy needed to be done in order to ignite your competitive spirit. But why would you do that? What's your objective? I wanted to do something for you as another person who is free from Matarame's chains. That's all. Huh? Matarame held a grudge against me for supposedly stealing his customers from him. To start, I couldn't get anyone to rent me space for exhibits. He caused me no end of hardship. So that's why. Yes, the heart of man is painted with desire, even if it's coated entirely in black at times. However, it seems you have the strength to not look away from it, and chose to stand up against it. If only he had your strength. Matarame and I go back a long way. First as classmates, then as teachers at the same art school. He used to have a noble spirit. Said he wanted to aim for the top of the art world one day. Huh? But in the end, even the art world has its share of politics. Those who are cunning win. Our hearts were stained black in that manner. But the human heart is a strange thing. It can't completely separate black from white. I was shocked when I heard that he took you in. He never liked children, you see. Oh? This happened just before we cut all ties from each other. But I got a call from him. He was panicking that nearby clinics were closed and that his kid had a fever. Sensei. Yeah. I don't want any more losers like me or misguided winners like him being born from this world. That's why I started this foundation. So how about it? Would you like our support? <laughs> Without the overbearing marketing production, of course. It's a truly kind offer. Thank you for your generosity. However, I must respectfully decline. Huh. What makes you say that? I am not Madarame. I won't be stained by desire. 
After all, I can see hope. If I am lost, they will extend their hands. If I am wrong, they will chastise me. As long as I have my rays of hope to guide me, I will be fine. Ha! Madarame really did have a good eye. <laughs> what a strange man. For declining his offer? It is a tad wasteful of me to decline. Still, I believe it's for the best. I feel contradictory, but that's the human heart, correct? <sighs> Interesting. That's exactly what I should be painting. It must have been troublesome dealing with me, but for some reason, I knew that you wouldn't abandon me until everything was said and done. Thank you, my friend. shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the Emperor, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. Persona within me has awakened to a new power. All right. Now that I'm out of my slump, I need to make up for the time I wasn't able to paint. I reiterate my promise to you. I'll extend my assistance to you, should you ever stumble. Now then. Shall we go? In order for me to learn more about the heart, we need to work hard on our thief business. stories online about horrible hosts like Tsukasa all the time. However, we'll need solid proof of what he's doing if we're going to convince Eiko. I believe some of the promoters around here may know something. As my father always said, finding evidence takes serious legwork.
Hey! Did you notice this? We have proof, come on. Do it. Interesting. Hmm. 